You regret everything that happened on Saturday? Do I regret it? Yeah. I mean, it was just really a miscommunication between me, the coaches, and the trainer. You know, I should have handled it different instead of just telling them like that. But, you know, it was miscommunication. They wouldn't respond to me, going back and telling them exactly what was going on. And then they figured out the injury really was serious than what it was. So, you know, it was all right. What do you feel about people kind of saying you kind of taking the year off, the rest of the year off, kind of get ready for uh, I mean, that's people's opinion. You know, I'm here with my team every day, practicing with my team. Yeah, the people say what they want to say. They're not here. They're not locker room around the coaching staff with us. So I, I know what's going on around us. And we 4-1, we're just trying to keep winning games. That's all, that's all we can do. Will you be able to play against Arkansas? That's questionable, you know. It just depends on how I'm feeling. When will you know? <laughs> Whenever I start feeling good, I start I give out some like how I really feel. I mean, how it's going. When did you hurt it? How are you feeling right now? Uh, I mean, it's, it's bothering me. You know, I can't really run. I can't run right now. So when I start back running, I'll be right there. When did you do it? You I did it last uh, Saturday's game. I got hit, but then I, I pulled my I pulled my tennis and muscles in uh, uh, practice on Wednesday, and I couldn't run after that. Maybe no college football player has been through what just everything that you've been through. Yeah. I mean, can you even begin to describe just? I mean, it's been sort of a roller coaster with the hit and the attention and this and that. Nah, I, you know, I don't, I don't care, you know. So I know there's a lot of scrutiny going on, a lot of people talking. So you know, that's what people do talk. You know, something to talk about. There's something they just want to talk about. You know, I'm just sitting back laughing about it. I know my situation with the team, and I know what we're trying to do. Our goals are still out there for us. And I'm just trying to look for a big year. Your what teammates your really backed you up this morning and, and, <laughs> and, and, and talked about how much you've done for this university. Your coach said, this, said the same thing. I mean, um, everybody seems to be on the same page. Uh, yeah, I mean, I've always been about the team. Regardless of what people say, I've been about my team my whole life. So I dedicate myself to this team and this university. That's why I chose to come here. And I'm just going to keep doing what I have to do and get better and come back out there and play. Were you surprised that Paul Feinbaum called you the biggest joke in college football this season? <laughs> he can say what he wants, you know? Again, that's his opinion. I, it don't bother me. I just know why I stay. I know what I can do out there on the field. I know my abilities, and I know I'm a pretty good athlete, regardless of what anybody says. As far as today, he kind of rallied around you, kind of took you back today, saying well, folks should be happy you came to South Carolina. How does that kind of make you feel? I mean, I mean he, as long as he, they know, you know, my teammates know. Uh, that's all that matters. I mean, coach staff know I chose coming for a reason. You know, I want to do something different. I want to win, you know. So we up on the rise. We just 4 one. People are like we one and four the way they covered after. So, but it's gonna get better. We're just gonna keep working, get doing what we gotta do. Is you that the frustrating part about committed this? To this team? Frust frustrated? Is that the frustrating part? I mean, you guys are four and one. I mean, people do act like I you're mean, one and four. And that's fine, you know, I'm not frustrated. Other people frustrated way more than I am. I'm just said to do my job, do what I gotta do. I'm, I'm a young kid, just having fun with it. You know, that's all it's about to be anyway, going to school, having fun, playing football. So I just look at it and just take it in stride and just do what I got to do. How Are badly you do you want to be back on this team? field? Am I fully committed? Yeah. Always. Regardless of what people think, I'm here. I, t I didn't sit out. I could have sat out. I'm not looking to sit out. I ain't never been like my type of guy. I'm, I'm not the type of guy. You know, I'm here with the team regardless. And I'm here to work with the team. And then when I get back healthy, they know I'm coming out there to play and do my job. Do I got to take care of business on the field? And for the record, you enjoy playing football. Oh, yeah, I enjoy playing. I have to come out here every day. <laughs> I mean, I've been here. I should know that by now. <laughs> Jadavion, the truth is you do have other things to consider. I mean, uh, does that ever enter your mind? Nah, man. It's like take one day at a time, you know. I'm not, I'm not, I'm in college. I'm playing for this university right now. Regardless of what people say, I'm still in college playing for the university. So I'm going to do that. And, just get ready for the future. I ain't looking for the past. So we got Arkansas coming up. That's what I'm on right now. Exactly what is this injury? Uh, I really got to pull muscle tendons inside uh, on my ribs. And it's bothering me when I really try to run and do quick moves. So uh, they know what's going on now. So they just really try to treat it, trying to get it back. Does it bother you that some of these people make these comments and they, they they don't know you? I mean, some of these people have really That's never even been around you. You really just, you just say it to yourself. They don't know me. So uh, I don't care, you know. People don't know me. Uh, half people in the world don't know me. They always assume and stuff, so make assumption of what's going on in my life, you know. As long as I know where I stand uh, with the team and everybody else. So I'm not here to play for everybody. I'm here to play for my team and uh, this university, so have fun with it. <laughs> I understand you're questionable for Arkansas, but do you feel confident you'd be back against Tennessee, or is this something that could linger? What's your uh, understanding of the time? Period? I don't have no time. This is an injury that I'm going to have to wait and see and see how I feel about it. Are you able to do anything physically? I mean, if you're not able to run, you're probably not able to lift. I mean, yeah, I mean, stuck. I'm doing curls and stuff, dumbbells and stuff, but I mean, it's really bothering me not really try to run and turn and too quick. And they do electrical stem? Yeah, they're doing a little bit of that, a little bit of everything. Anything else? So you can ice it? You ice it, it, heat it. I mean, anything you think of, we just trying to get it back fast.
You didn't get the chance you played your last game here? <laughs> no, I haven't played my last game here. Uh, I will be back on the field. I just don't know how long it's going to take me to get back, but I will be back playing.